Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be showing you my Battle of the World War One Battle of the Saw map. So yeah, um, here we have the lobby. Here's the German infantry. Um, there's a suit. Get out of that mode real quick. All right, here's the gas grenade, Gewehr 95, and bayonet. That's the German flag. Here's the British flag, British infantry. Here we have the gas grenade, SMLE MK1, and the bayonet. Let's walk over here. Here's the Canadian infantry. There's the Canadian flag, Ross MK1, gas grenade, and a bayonet. French infantry, here's the French flag, Lebel 1889, gas grenade, and a bayonet. Basically all the same, just the gun's different, not anything. So, at the time British owned many countries, brought them back up. The countries that were involved in this battle was Britain, of course, Canada, Australia, South Africa, Dominion, Dominion of Newfoundland, Dominion of New Zealand, British Raj and India. Those were all the ones that British owned. So here's Britain and all the countries that French colonized that were good. The bad ones were just the German Empire. 500k British troops were involved. 150k French troops were involved too. So um, on the first day the British army suffered 57k casualties. So those were historical facts about it. If we walk over here, here's honorable mentions. There's the creator, Me Machine 510, me. The admin slash helper minted pencil, FC Barker kicker, and Soldat Schmidt, uh, add us on Xbox. Teleports. So here's the German trenches. I think I got this style from a uh, Soldat 1917. Go subscribe to his channel, and check him out. Um, well, I got the, you know, well here's the trench periscope. Here's a little thing to see the um, no man's land. Now the British trenches. <coughs> Here's the British trenches. Um, I also got this this style from sold by 1917. There's a little no man's land. Not little actually. And here's the British retreat trenches. Those are just backup trenches if they get if their front trenches get captured. So, here's it. So, I'm going to show you the no man's land now. There's a lot of Bob Dwyer. Um, so, yeah. Here is the little British trenches that I told you about. Then you have a lot of barbed wire. Got this from, um, I got the three lines of barbed wire from a picture that I found. Here is the rest of it. It's pretty long. That's how long it is. Here's a tank. British Mark V tank, I'm pretty sure is what it's called. Um, so yeah. Here, that is. A bunch of craters. Go ahead and, um, turn my rinse and rend uh, distance render thing up because it makes it look better. Render distance chunks up. It looks way better with it down so yeah here's what the map looks like fully a lot of craters now this is we have to build a map because i don't know if you saw but there's a flat land around it it's a flat world so we have to build all this and that means we have to build under where we're going to explode it so yeah tell me what you guys think about this map hope you guys enjoyed the video tell us tell me in the comment section what you think about this and i will see you guys later hope you have a good day